What's up everyone, it's Sam here and today I'm gonna talk about PlayStation Plus. As of, is it January 25th, Saturday, what do we have as a free game? You know, free games actually, it's not only one game but you know, a couple games. Brothers A Tale of Two Sons. You guys remember that game when I was like talking all about it and I was like What? Should I get this? Yeah. And, you know with two brothers walking together and all that. You know I did cover this game But now we have it for free. It's kind of cool. Really awesome that Sony gave us a, this game for free. You know it's awesome. Worms Battle Island is also for free. It's kind of cool, awesome game. I remember in the 90s we used to play on PC and <laughs> that was a pretty fun game, you know. The game I really enjoyed downloading. They gave it to us for free. The third game which is Bioshock Infinite. It's true that I do have this game on CD, you know, the collector's edition. They give you a CD and you just have to take it out and put it in the disc tray but as a downloadable you know I've been playing the DLC you know Bioshock Infinite uh, buried at uh, sea is it something like that and uh, I don't need to like pop you know the CD you know get the CZ, uh, CD out of the package and just you know put it in the disc tray so right now we have it for free uh, on PlayStation Plus which is pretty cool as you guys remember, Bioshock Infinite has this full, colorful storyline talking about what happened to Booker Duet. His, you know, I, I'm trying my best not to spoil the story for people who didn't play it. But if we want to count, Bioshock Infinite, it's around $60 before. Right now, maybe $40, something like that. And like PlayStation Plus is about. Um, it's about $50. It is $50. And just imagine you get so much games. Like you get Bioshock Infinite for free. And that's a subscription of a year. And each week, PlayStation Plus, they have free games. Old games, new games, all kind of games. You know, arcade, indie games, and shooters. I remember they did give us last week Borderlands 2. And that game is one of the AAA titles that have like full immersive uh, audience and uh, this, uh, I really play I never played Borderlands uh, first the first one and or Borderlands 2 but after playing that game you know it's cooperative for players it's really fun and uh, I, I you guys should try it out if you didn't try Borderlands 2 Devil May Cry uh, I really enjoyed it you know I did finish the single player and it was really enjoyable, you know, the storyline, uh, you, you know me guys, I really love a good quality story. So that's what I got with Devil May Cry and it's for free, it's for free, what are you, what's the loss, you know? You just have to pay like for example $50 a year and you get so much free games. So I really want to cover so much more, you know, PlayStation Plus, there's so many games which are free like don't starve on the playstation 4 i didn't cover that yet but it's an enjoyable survival horror game I, I you know i'm trying to get the grip of it but it's a very challenging to be honest and a uh, sweet game sweet game so thank you a lot for much, uh, for watching this video and it would help me a lot if you subscribe leave a comment give me a thumbs up you guys are awesome you guys take care